Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Just a quick video to update you. Windows 10 KB 5001330, that was the cumulative update that rolled out earlier this week for April's Patch Tuesday for Windows 10 2004 and 20H2. Unfortunately, the update is causing some problems of its own, and I've had some reports back on this channel and also have uh, done some research and apparently there have been user reports of installation issues, performance issues, temporary user profile bug issues and the dreaded blue screen of death. So this is the update I'm talking about. If you just go to your Windows update in your settings, view update history, I'm talking about KB5001330. It was a quality mandatory update, so it was installed or will be installed automatically on your machine. Now, there is no fix as yet, and um, Microsoft has been keeping very quiet, but the only solution that you can really do at the moment to solve your problem, if you unfortunately have been having any of those issues, is to go to your uh, uninstall updates, and you just go down to the bottom under Microsoft Windows, and just find KB5001330, click on it, click on uninstall at the top of the page and let the uninstallation process run and then restart your PC and that will take the update off your PC and hopefully fix your problems until Microsoft comes up with a solution. Now just be aware though, after you restart your computer, after you've uninstalled the update, that because it is a compulsory mandatory update, it will just download and install automatically again. So what you need to do is you need to pause your updates for seven days or you can also go to advanced options and under pause updates you can choose a date further on down the line just to be safe and then once the bugs have been ironed out or there is a fix to the solution you can come and resume the updates and I will um, update you as soon as I know more on this problem with KB5001330 causing installation issues, performance issues, blue screens of death and so on. Just wanted to keep you updated. I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.